What is up YouTube, Roger here. Um, just a quick video because I thought this was pretty funny. Um, I basically recorded this clip a few weeks ago and uh, I forgot I had it until I found it earlier today. Uh, but I figured I'd upload it because it's quite amusing. And uh, I'm not sure if these bots still exist actually. They uh, look like Squeal of Fortune bots that just home port to Lumbridge and trade. Um, another account and give all of that wealth to that account in which case you trade that account that is being traded the stuff and it will try and trade you and it will chase you um so basically in this case you can see the guy uh being traded the stuff is vandax and <laughs> basically you can just trade them and run and they will follow you literally anywhere you like if if there are several of the several of them which sometimes there are um you can trade them all and they will all chase you so you can have an army of bots chasing you around which is pretty funny um i'm not entirely sure if it's possible to get anything from these um because a lot of soft rewards go in the bank um but it's quite fun to do uh yeah so i'm not really sure how that how that'll work with cash bags now i'm not sure if the cash bags will drop on the floor and give you what's in the cash bag or what but i i think it's an initiative to um stop squill of fortune bots being made and, and and abused but um basically you can just ch uh you know get them to follow you any way you want which is which is pretty funny uh there are some that are like uh 34 total that will not go past the drain or boundaries and you'll see in this video that i take them to hobgoblin south of the crafting guild but it's also possible to take them to the vines in uh where drain or manor is um you can have them stand there but you have to keep trading them and moving them like one or two squares otherwise they'll get bored and try and home telly um and once you get them to the vines the vines will kill them anyway and you can just stand them there and yeah, I think if you trade them and walk it a couple squares anyway, just in case it logs out because of inactivity or whatever, um, that'll be a good thing too. But yeah, it's just a fun thing to do. Not really a good money maker, but you know, uh, you guys seem to love killing bots regardless of whether you make money or not. Um, I'm not sure if these bots exist anymore. If they don't, then I guess it's just something funny to see. If it, they do, then post a comment below and let me know and uh also i'm going to be making a video on bot watch and gold farmers and uh things that jagex are doing to prevent bots you know um in my next video which should be a day or two's time hopefully i'm going to try and get all the information ready and put it into a video and explain to you what's going on because a lot of people seem to be quite clueless about the whole bot watch situation and what a gold farmer is and what a player is and what the difference is and all kinds of so i'm going to go into all those details in my next video and sort of try and do you know a, a decent length video where i sort of discuss everything about the whole system and uh obviously things that i'm allowed to say not stuff that is confidential um not that i know anything that's confidential anyway but you know uh i have spoken to jack mob and gotten permission to say a few things so um i will be saying that when i make that video so if you want to see my previous video about um more bot watch bands then click the link on screen that will take you to that video and check that out other than that thanks for watching and i hope you enjoyed this video cheers guys see ya if you'd like to see more of my videos, hit the link to the left to check out my Completionist Quickie series, hit the link to the right to check out my PVM Droplog series, or hit the link at the bottom to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed.